What is up everybody? This is SuperSight and welcome back to another video of Heyday. Now this video, I've been looking forward to doing this one. This one is a very exciting video. Well, I look forward to doing all the videos, uh, but this one here is quite exciting. And it is about an OP product, uh, overpowered in the sense that it has the potential to do a lot. It will change Heyday forever, that I can say. Now this product, uh, is, it's, it's literally, it's the highlight of my update. Day. And this product, this product, I've got so much statistics and stuff to say about this product, which I'll be saying throughout this whole video. There is so much going on with this product. It is a crazy, crazy product. And so the product I'm going to be talking about is the Wheat Bundle. That's right. The Wheat Bundle is indeed, to, to be like, to be fully honest, it is the highlight of the update for me, for me personally. Uh, I love everything in the update, it's really good, but the Wheat Bundle especially is an incredible product, and I'll tell you why throughout the video. Right, so let's go straight to the event and look at it. We are getting close, but sadly not close enough. We are not going to make it, we, we're just going to miss it, and that is very, very sad. Very sad. We are, it's... Oh, it's painfully sad uh, because we've come so far and got so close but not close enough uh, so uh, anyway that's just the reality of what it is we're gonna miss the hug statue but anyway I still love the uh, the global event so that's not to reflect negatively on the revives the revive events I still love the revive events uh, they they're the best events uh, for me personally I love the revive events uh, but it is quite sad that we're not gonna get the statue but hey and look at that top neighborhood, up to 229,000 revives, and let's see the top player, what in the banter, 216,000, that is not right, that's like, wow, that's, that's insane, that's like, literally, he's obviously, he must be in that top neighborhood, because he's got more than, wow, and, and that second player must be in the second neighborhood as well, and the third player in the third neighborhood. That is so funny. That is unbelievably funny. Because, for example, let's, uh, the, the top player right here, uh, we'll go to his farm. Uh, wait, right, no, not in that farm. Right, okay, so I'm just, okay, I'm, I've just, uh, uh, this isn't a calculation. I've just obviously made a mistake in the digits. Right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, right, no, flip it. Right, okay, uh, let's see this guy. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right, they they should be in this neighborhood, right? That's okay. That doesn't seem right. Okay, um, I think I've uh right. It, it's uh, that doesn't make make sense because that player has over two hundred thousand revives. Yet the top neighborhoods, there's only one that has over two hundred thousand revives. Hence, that player should be in that neighborhood. Uh, I don't. That doesn't seem to make sense. Uh, I'm not sure. That that's that's not right. That really is not right. That. What that um that uh, that's so that's called love and has eighteen players, right? And then if we go to this and we go to the top neighborhoods, that is that that's I that, I think there's a mistake there, uh, unless it's just me. But the top neighborhood has two hundred thirty thousand revives, but only one player has over two hundred uh has over. Two, so one player has over 200,000 revives, only one top neighborhood has over 200,000 revives, hence that top player should and has to logically be in that top thing. Anyway, that, that isn't the point of the video, that just doesn't seem right. Uh, anyway, right, okay, so we have a full barn uh, and a full, right, not quite full silo. Okay, so we'll go ahead and we'll harvest this uh, and the bees, right, okay, we are really full and that is really annoying. Ah, uh, yes, that's right, I just remembered, right, so I'll just plant this. And then we are going to get reputation level up to level 7. That's right. I've saved it for this video. Uh, even though I forgot temporarily that, that was going to be part of the video. Uh, I saved it because I have lots of them ready to be collected. Uh, right. Uh, that's annoying. Uh, there we go. And now we can get the bees back in action. Okay. And... The Wheel of Awesome, that's right, let's spin it, uh, this is going to be good, this is going to be good, what's it going to be, it is going to be, what's it going to be, and it's going to be, you know, no, that's yes and no, that's yes and no, because I know that's not right, okay, that was dumb, that is a great thing, but look, look, select one, swap, no, that's stupid of me, Ah, oh, that's really annoying, Ah, oh, that is so dumb, dang it. Right, okay, wait, what if we don't, 
swap it, but we start using one of them. Right, so we finally tapped him for the very first time. Uh, that's pretty funny because I've been told to use him many times. Okay, let's give it a try. Right, okay, no, we certainly don't want that. We want the necklaces. Because uh, I actually use Unlock Necklaces, the top valued product, this thing. Right, okay, so, oh, and we've got the th three days of free. Okay, this is, I failed that miserably. Right, so we'll go start searching. Right, and then he'll come back and we'll get him to order. Okay, that failed. Okay, so I will do a Tom video on the future, uh, but that that was not how I intended it to be. Uh, right, okay, go Tom. You got this. That, he is a fast runner. Okay, and then he's going to come back. Uh, right, I'm actually, I'm not going to get the farm going in action. Uh, right, okay, well, why is getting that? Let's go and get reputation level up. That's right. Oh, oh yeah, and I think we can upgrade something. Right, okay, tap, here we go, and right, okay, will this get us up, will this get us up, right, because we want the new passengers, uh, right, tap, tap, no, what, no, what, where did I tap, come on, D don't say I missed it, don't say I missed my, like, leveling up, come on, are you kidding me, are you kidding me, are you kidding me, no, oh, we, we got, no, that's not right, no, no! Oh, that is annoying. That is seriously annoying. That, oh, come on. Well, at least I got it on the video. Like, I tried. I tried, and then I failed miserably by, the, okay, that's really not right. Okay, but look at all those gifts. Talk about gifts. That is awesome. Right, okay, can we upgrade? Oh, this will free up some space. Phew. Oh, that's nice. Uh, what about this? Okay. Oh, yes. That is what, all right, should we do coins or time? Um, uh, let's just go coins. Okay, so coins, uh, right, there is a mathematical formula to work out which one, but I haven't done the mathematical formula yet. Right, so we've upgraded that. Okay, we can't do it again. Right, over here, upgrade. Oh, we can do that. Okay, that is going to free us up a lot of space. Right, okay, so, and then over here. Okay, get some customers. Uh, right, okay, your grocery store, uh, cinema, let's see. Uh, okay, that's full. Uh, right, uh, no, oh, diner, yes, you, no, I'll go, uh, Sophia in the diner, right, uh, no, uh, not yet, uh, oh, no, that, no, okay, I'll see about that one, uh, yes, uh, not yet, right, uh, who else have we got, uh, okay, so bed and breakfast, right, you can go on the bed and breakfast, no, okay, I do have some of these things back at home, which is good, bed and breakfast, uh, nope, uh, diner, nope, nope, uh, right, and then we have the hippo, uh, no, <laughs> the hippo, the elephant, right, I've decided not to name the animals, uh, for now, maybe in a future episode I will, uh, but for now I'm just gonna call, uh, him or her, the elephant, or the grey elephant. Right, oh, and we, we have our first feed, we have our very first feed, we have never fed any animal, wait, like, zoo animal before, on this, I've never done it before in the history of Heyday, uh, like, well, for me, like, but I have, a, like, a fairly short history because I've just unlocked it. Anyway, here we go. Boom. Whoa, it's going in. Whoa, that eat it, ate it quick. Right, another. Oh, whoa. Whoa, that is a big, I don't think, I think that's, like, a bit out of size considering uh, what I had. Whoa. It's eating it. It's eating it. It likes it. That's a good thing. I hope it likes it, because uh, that's all it's got. Right. Okay. Let's. Uh, right. Yes. Let's get that. And visitors. Okay. We can get four more. Right. Okay. Let's go to this farmer. Whoa. Okay. More than four right there. Right. Okay. So we can get. Okay. So we'll go home. Right. I do have a lot to say in this video, so I, I'll try and. Uh, and cinema's always full, so we'll get rid of uh, the. I mean, not cinema. The the diner is always full, so we'll get rid of diner visitors. Okay. And now we can go and collect six visitors from here. Right, okay, so, uh, yes, right, yes, 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 okay, and bed and breakfast, right, okay, maybe I'll, I don't know, that's, okay, we have, we, we have so many, uh, bed and breakfast slots, so we'll go for bed and breakfast, uh, right, and then I guess cinema, and that's all of them, right, so, okay, well, Gary, that's a lot of, uh, players, Right, so then that will chug in uh, my personal train. Oh, it's got them. Right, and then come back here, and it will come out here, and then all that's filled up. Right, okay, so we're going to have to find uh, food kind of stuff for them. Right, okay, so going home, and uh, right, so this here. It's so annoying having a full barn. Uh, I Right, this is annoying. Okay, uh, can we... Right, okay, I'm just looking... This is really annoying. I, uh, it's like everything's just so clogged up. I'll get rid of some iron bars. Right, so then I can feed my animals. Uh, right, okay, so I'll feed my animals. 
Right, okay, feeding the animals, and then I will get on with talking about all the very interesting stuff I have to say this video, uh, which, yeah, okay, so feeding them, uh, like so, uh, feeding over here, like so, right, like so, there we go, right uh, over here, and get in there, awesome, right, and then, uh, right there, tap there, can we get another honey, yes we can, uh, right, okay, one, two, and like so, there we go, finally getting through it and getting most of the machines back in action, well, trying to, it's just, it's so difficult, uh, okay, well, it's, I don't know, it's not difficult, but I, I have lots of stuff to say, this video, so I want to get it done fairly quickly, right, okay, that's a lot of them going, uh, that's right, okay, now, it's, it's like, now I'm just like impatient, I just want to get everything done when I know it can't be done that quickly, Right, and then over here, and we've got this machine, right, 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 and right. Okay, I did need some other stuff, never mind. Uh, brown sugar, wait, how much white sugar? Okay, we need white sugar constantly. Uh, right, okay, so going through there, and getting this here with wheat, we'll do in there, right up here. Okay, and then we can get some, we've got some of the visitor requirement stuff now. Uh, right, okay, and there, and over here we do that, and then pancakes in here. Uh, right, okay, can't do pancakes yet. Right, okay, that will keep that going. Uh, right, okay, there we go. And there's some good stuff. And a purple voucher. And we'll get going that one. Right, and another one when we get back. Right, right, right. Right, and right, okay. And then we'll harvest this and we'll put on soybeans. And then we'll start talking about the wheat bundle. Right, okay, so... Finally, I get to talk about what I've been looking forward to. Right, okay. The carrots in there. Okay, that, that ought to do. That's like majority of the farm going. Maybe not. Uh, who knows? Uh, okay, right, and then, right, okay, let's, okay, never mind, I, this is like, no, you don't want to do this, you always, okay, yes, Tom's got a quota, right, always go for the maximum one, because you sell it and make masses of coins, right, and then he'll come back and then sleep for two hours, uh, anyway, right, okay, so, getting into the video, uh, about, about the wheat bundle, finally, yes, Finally, yay! Okay, so the weed bundle right here produced in feed mill, one hour and 25 minutes, right? Okay, tap, okay, and then there, one hour and 25 minutes with the one star, uh, and then it's one and a half hours with no stars, and it's 76 minutes with three stars. Not sure about two stars, but that, that's really irrelevant, even though most of you will have two stars, probably. Uh, one to two stars is a few people have three stars. Oh, and he's back, he's back, tap. Oh yes, nine, okay, we'll sell that off for a sweet profit, because we bought those for about 2,000, right? And then we'll sell them off, well, nine of them, nine of them, I'll just show you what, nine, uh, Look at all that profit. That's like four and a half thousand profit. That is a lot of profit. Right, so uh, go, always go for the most expensive thing with Tom. Right, that is going to rake in some profit. Right, okay, so uh, I'll just put on a bush revive. Okay, I should have right. Uh, okay, so tap, tap, and then right, move that in there. Okay, no, and then move that out of there, then move that in there, and then advertise that, and then... Yes! Okay, now we've done most of what we need to do, and then Tom is now sleeping. Okay, for two hours. That's a long sleep. And then, I think we're going to have to delete one of the boosters. That is really sad. Uh, I should have... That was very poor uh, on my behalf. I definitely should have... I shouldn't have done what I did, because I was just trying to... S those booster things, I should have just used them. Uh, why did I tap on that? I don't need that. I Coal ore. Right, okay. And uh, any revives... Uh, any revives, right, there's that there, that's good, right, uh, revives, uh, he hasn't even, okay, someone else has done that, anyway, okay, going back to Greg, seeing what Greg has got, good things from Greg, okay, now getting into the video, finally, even though this is like, this is not how you leave a farm, you get everything going, but this is a very important video, right, okay, so, uh, now, my, as I said in my last video, uh, I think this is my prediction, I think that the, uh, eventually, this, uh, the Daily Dirt will begin filling up, uh, with the wheat bundles, as there isn't enough demand for, for them, and as more people, uh, are gonna be producing them, then, uh, people need them, because the, the only thing currently they can be used for is to feed the animals, Animals. Uh, visitors won't buy them, boats won't order them, and trucks won't get them, and so uh, it's, it's a problem because the, there's way too much supply of them, uh, but I'll, I'll talk about that in because I've, I've got a list of stuff that I've written down that I want to talk about because there's so many, this is a, just an incredible 
product. It's so unique. It's so amazing. Right, so now uh, this year, the idea that it's going to fill up and just be full of wheat uh, bundles eventually, alongside wheat, but also lots of wheat bundles, is completely my idea. Uh, I'm making a guess, and based on what I've seen so far, it's not what I've, what I'm guessing that it's going to fill up with uh, wheat bundles isn't going to happen, because uh, for the, since it came out about uh, five days ago, uh, I have gone through, constantly be going through my hundred friends, uh, not looking to buy them, because I can make them, but just uh, to, to look for other things as I usually do, and the people that are following me, and I've only seen four different stalls selling them. Four different stalls in total. So I have seen very, very few for sale. Only four different shops selling them, and, and that includes the Daily Dirt, although the Daily Dirt uh, it has that the glitch, because uh, the level 1,000... The level 1000 glitch means that then it doesn't show in the Daily Dirt, so uh, if people advertise it, it won't show up. Uh, but even if it did, I, I doubt many people are selling it yet. But um, I reckon that's yet to change. Now, as I said before, this is uh, my own idea, uh, my own guess. It'll be funny if it's wrong, because then it'll be like, wow, I failed that badly. Uh, anyway, I'm guessing that. I'm guessing that it's going to fill up with that. Uh, I'm just uh, right, so, and as I said, I've only seen f four times, so it's, uh, it seems unlikely, but my future predic prediction is that it will. Right, now, I think that a great idea for uh, the wheat bundle is that we could make, a, the Supercell could make a decoration called a big hay bale, which you would create, uh, like, uh, like, maybe in the feed mill, and it requires 500 to 1,000 wheat bundles. Now, the reason I say this is because since I believe that this is going to fill up with wheat bundles eventually uh, because uh, people aren't going to be demanding them as much as people uh, are supplying them, then there's going to be a ton of excess, and currently there's a ton of excess of wheat. Uh, and so I think that if you made a massive, you could like make decorations like a mass hay bale, which, which was like can, made up of like 500 to 1,000 wheat bundles, that would massively reduce the wheat. Uh, and and it, you could either just buy it and it would immediately be, be made, or you could, like, create it. I don't know how long it would take to create. Uh, but that would drain it, like, so there'd be, like... Very few you could yeah, but you'd make it so like it, it becomes a decoration so they don't get profit from it They just get a cool decoration to keep but that would remove tons and tons of wheat because the wheat's gone into the wheat bundle And then the wheat bundles used up uh, so that's the idea uh, And the reason why uh, I say this is because it makes an exit channel So it, it in, in essence it's getting rid of the wheat because the wheat makes the wheat bundles and then the wheat bundles uh, are gone uh, But I seriously think that uh, this wheat bundles it's an absolutely genius idea uh, from Supercell. I absolutely love it that it is a perfect way to drain the wheat uh, Although the wheat will go into wheat bundles, and I think the wheat bundles will then start filling up the the thing uh, You'll see why it's not nearly as bad as if it's just wheat uh, Right, so I said that also uh, yeah, and also another exit channel that you could get rid of the wheat bundles Because uh, currently you'll be like well, there's no need to get rid of them But I, I trust me. I do believe that I think that there will be too many of them eventually So I think that if visitors requested them or boats requested them or they were truck orders part of it That would help get rid of them and then ultimately it's getting rid of the wheat uh, which is what we want uh, Yes, yeah, so that is something uh, different exit channels that uh, could be used uh, right, so, and so then that, that would be, uh, it's a great, uh, like, get, way of getting rid of the wheat. Right, now, now, here is the, there's like my favorite bit of the video. This has got, this has got to be my favorite bit of the video, and that is this. Uh, it, it's a pun that I thought up, because I was thinking a lot about all the different things in Heyday, uh, and all the different, uh, things uh, around this wheat bundle and that. And I was thinking, and I, I came up with this pun. I wasn't even trying to think of a pun. I was just thinking in my head about the wheat bundle. And then I just thought this through in my mind, this thought. And then I'm like, that is the most beautiful heyday pun that I've ever created. And it's this. Wheat bundles will solve the growing wheat problem. Get it? I, I just loved it. I, I, I just laughed at my own joke when I thought of it. I, it's so, I'll say it again. Wheat bundles will solve the growing wheat problem. And the, the reason why it's funny is because 
Like, for example, people normally grow wheat, you know, as in wheating, but it, 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 then they can't sell it, and it's, it's really annoying. So then when they grow wheat, uh, it, it's a problem. But then there's also a problem as in the, the growing amount of wheat, uh, it's becoming a problem. And so wheat bundles, I, lo- I, I don't know, I love my own pun. I think it's really funny because it's like wheat bundles will solve the growing wheat problem because it, it's, it's a growing wheat problem, like with people growing it and then the, the wheat problem's growing. I, I, I just, I like that one. So I thought I'd just put that in there. Uh, right, and so then uh, I think it's a very diverse product. Uh, and weeders will probably uh, use it because, uh, and this uh, this some very interesting fact right here, as it uses up wheat quicker than chicken feed, and even a fully mastered bakery producing bread. Now, just to put that into perspective, uh, see this uh, right here. So we got the wheat bundle here, and uh, right. So let's just tap one, and then it gives us three because uh, it produces three, just like the feed. This here produces, even though it takes one hour and twenty five minutes will use up, it will, it will like, it, as you could say, burn, it will burn up and use up more wheat than producing chicken feed. And and that is crazy. Uh, the chicken feed would be the same uh, star level in that. But if you compare, uh, for example, assuming you had a zero-starred feed mill, right, even if you're producing uh, the wheat bundle in a zero-starred uh, a zero starred, uh, feed mill, it would still be using up more wheat than producing uh, wheat in a fully starred bakery, which gets you, uh, then you can make it in four minutes. So I think that is an incredible statistic, because, uh, although it's not the most efficient way of getting, uh, rid of, like, well, it, it's a, it, it's not the, like, in the sense that you can sell it, but it's a very good way of getting rid of wheat. 75 per one hour, in my case, one hour, 25 minutes, uh, but when it's fully starred in 76 minutes. So that, I reckon that's really, really, uh, because 75, that is a lot of wheat. Uh, that's for, like, I guess, like, maybe one harvest for most players, because I've got, how many fields? I've got 63, and that's 65. So that's, like, a whole harvest of wheat just gone. And then you can fill up one, two, three, four, five, six slots in and, and both of them. So that gets rid of tons and tons and tons of wheat. So I thought that's fascinating that it gets rid of wheat quicker. At, and not, I'm not just meaning, like, by putting one in. I'm meaning in one hour and 25 minutes. You would have got rid of more wheat by producing a wheat bundle than you would have been producing bread in a fully starred uh, bakery uh, that was mastered constantly, which I think is very fascinating. Uh, and so that that's just an interesting fact I thought I would put out there. Uh, right, I'm just looking at the other things I have uh, to say uh, because I, I just I, I had so much to say, and it's annoying when I have to write it down. I had so many ideas about it that I, I didn't want to. Forget them and miss them out. Uh, so sorry if it's sort of a little bit delayed. Uh, right. So then, uh, right. So and, and as I said before, currently it doesn't show in the market uh, because of the level uh, thousand glitch. Because you have to be level thousand to buy it in theory. So when you advertise, it can't market. Even if it was, uh, I doubt that many people would be selling it yet. But I reckon in the future uh, it will become a big, big thing, and there'll be tons of it. Uh, right. And so now this is this is what I love. This this, this is probably my well no my second favorite. But my pun was the I love my pun. That was a good pun. I think so. But you guys will get to dis- you, you, you guys decide that. Uh, right. Anyway, uh, right. So the fascinating, uh, this is the, fa- I love, I love the properties of its profitability and it's very fascinating and very incredible. Now I did see a form about, uh, I, and I'd already, yeah. Anyway, I did see a form like, uh, yeah, I saw a form about someone complaining about it, but, uh, I'd, I'd, I'd like, I hadn't worked out the calculations by that point, but I had a rough idea of how well it would produce. But this product is genius. I love it how Supercell's done it. Right, and in regards to profitability in it. Right, so this here can either be a very profitable pro- profitable product or or a loss product. You you can lose coins creating that, and you think, how can it be like a, a, re- a profitable, a reasonably profitable uh, item, and yet at the same time lose coins? That is because, look at the main ingredient. Guess what it is? Wheat. How much can you buy wheat for? You can buy it for, per one wheat, uh, you can buy it for uh, 0.1 coins per wheat, because it's you can buy a bundle of 10, uh, not, not a bundle, uh, like, you know, 10 in a shop. You can buy 10 wheat for one coin, which is 0.1 coins per wheat, which brings the total cost of it to 7.5 coins. 
or you can buy it, uh, you can buy it for 3.6 coins each, you know, 10 for 36, which I think, I, don't quote me, I think the total's like, uh, 230 coins, uh, to, to make it like that, which is a massive different, I think it's 270 coins, but that's about 265 coins different in, in how much it co uh, costs to produce, and so I, I've worked out for the, uh, if it's not starred at all, and if it's fully starred, at three different wheat prices, how much it will make per hour. Right, okay, so I'll start with the standard price. And this is the price I use for all, uh, for all regular wheat things. Obviously, and, and that is, uh, I'm assuming that wheat is one wheat for one coin. Uh, so like 10 wheat for 10 coins. Uh, because in the market, you, there's a lot of it for sale, 36 coins for 10. There's a few of it for sale at, uh, 10 for one coin, and a reasonable amount at 10 for 10 coins. So I, it's very small to assume that you can buy, you have access always to be able to buy 10 wheat for 10 coins. Uh, that, I think that's a, as much wheat as you want for one coin per wheat. That's a fair assumption. Although, if you're really clever, uh, and bought up lots of it at the times you found it for 10 coins, uh, one coin for 10 wheat, that, that would mean it's lower. But I'm, uh, this is for the assumption that you're buying it at the regular price, uh, which I've done the other calculations for. So all wheat, all things that include wheat, such as bread, cookies, uh, raspberry muffins, blackberry muffins, all assume that the wheat costs one coin. Uh, and so if, if we were assuming that the wheat costs one coin and all 75 of it, uh, so then that would bring the cost to 75 coins, assuming that you, uh, for, to make the wheat bundle, Assuming you could get, had access to that, which everyone does, you would make, uh, in a non-starred feed mill, 50.8 coins per hour. And in a fully mastered uh, feed mill, you would make 60.2 coins per hour. So that is reasonable. Now it gets better. Uh, so, assuming you, uh, it, it gets better and worse, but it's, it's better for me in the fact it gets worse. It's just because it's such a unique product. Now, assuming that you could buy all the wheat for 0 0.1 coins. Now, uh, I know some of you will buy some of it for slightly more and slightly less, uh, and then the, the I'm, I'm doing this based on the average. So if the average price that you got the wheat for was one coin, that is how much you'd make. Uh, but you might buy it for different prices, but I always buy mine for 10, uh, 10 wheat, uh, one, one wheat for one coin or less. Uh, I never pay more than uh, never pay more than that because I don't have to. Right, so assuming you could buy all your wheat for 0 0.1 coins uh, each, uh, which is uh, the equivalent of 10 wheat for one coin, uh, which is entirely possible, especially if you've got a big silo, you can just go in and when you see players selling it for that price, buy it all and then use that wheat rather than always paying 10 coins uh, for 10 wheat. So assuming you could buy it for that, in an unstarred feed mill, you would make 95.8 coins per hour and if you could get it in, uh, in, uh, right, I'm just thinking, right, and if you could get it in, right, still, uh, okay, yeah, I, I have it written down, I was just, I, I, I couldn't read it, right, uh, in a fully starred, uh, a fully mastered feed mill, you'd get 113.4 coins per hour, so that is pretty reasonable, if you ask me, pretty reasonable, 100 coins an hour from that, uh, but it gets better, uh, in a, in another sense, uh, so that's almost double, so almost double if you're buying it at the 0 0.1 coin price, uh, so that is interesting, so you can get about 100 coins an hour, uh, because it's roughly the same, uh, not start or fully mastered, about 100 coins an hour if you get it at 0 0.1 coins, and at one coin it's, uh, 50 to 60 coins an hour, depending on, uh, your feed mill mastery, uh, but this is my favorite bit, this is, like, yeah, it's got, it's my favorite bit. If if you buy at three point six coins an hour, and this is what the player uh, the player on the forms ADA forms was complaining about, it's it's a guess a justified complaint, but and and this is it's going to be funny because it's gonna it's gonna uh, catch people out, uh, and this this is what I love. If you in a non starred mastery. Uh, for every hour you produce wheat bundles and you're paying 3.6 coins for the wheat, you will be losing 79.2 coins per hour. 79.2. I love it. You lose coins for making it. Now, I think in the past, in heyday, there has been products that have lost m minor amounts of coins. I I'm not sure if the jelly bean still does that. Uh, I, I haven't checked recently. Uh, but there have been products in heyday that lose minor amounts of coins. But 79.2. That is a serious loss. And it gets, I, I love it, it gets better. If you're, if you're the good player and you've fully mastered your feed mill, you'll lose even more. You lose 93.8 coins per hour. So you're losing almost 100 coins per hour for every wheat bundle, uh, like that you're producing. Uh, like, as in, like, this whole thing that produces three. So, for every hour you produce this, you're losing 
like almost 100 coins an hour. Yet if you are buying the wheat at 0.1 coins, you're making 100 coins per hour. So I love the difference, how you can like make 100 coins per hour, or you can lose 100 coins per hour. I love that. That is so smart of Supercell. It, it's, it's really, really good. Because, uh, like, yeah, it's, it's really, really good. Uh, it will help with, uh, I've got a lot of ideas of, uh, the economics of Heyday, uh, like supply and demand and, uh, inflation and deflation and, and disinflate. Anyway, I have some ideas about that. And so, anyway, this, this isn't really gonna fix it. Uh, but, uh, it will, it will loot, it will take coins out of the game. Coins will be vanishing out of the game. Uh, no, that's, that's another video. But the fact is, people will be losing a hundred coins per every one of these they make approximately. They'll be losing more than that because it takes one hour and 30 minutes to on the mill. But for every hour they produce wheat bundles and they're buying the wheat at uh, 3.6 coins an hour, they'll be losing 93.8 coins an hour. I think that is just funny as Funny, funny, funny as yes. that is absolutely brilliant, uh, and so uh, and so you uh, those of you who are watching right now, I think you would be like, yeah, that is very, very helpful to know, uh, and I think I think it is, I think it is very useful for the players to know. Uh, I'm sure there'll be some uh, players uh, that won't realize that, obviously, uh, because they're you know all around the world, you know, people won't do the calculations and that. So I just thought I'd share it with you, so then you'll know uh, what price to pay uh, wheat, and I have worked out the break even price as well uh, but it, I just think it's funny how people uh, won't know and will be produced uh, obviously some people notice like the person in the forms uh, but obviously just I like it, I didn't reply to them but what they what they need to do is they just need to not buy wheat at 3.6 coins each because then they're right they are gonna lose coins so they've done sort of a, a semi equation to work it out how it lost coins but it does lose coins if you're paying too much for the wheat because wheat is the prime resource uh, so uh, then, yeah, so I just thought that was uh, very funny, and so now you guys know that, and that's very, very useful to know, uh, because you don't want to be producing that if you're paying too much for the wheat. Now, how much is the break-even point for the wheat? And so this is the key question, because then you'll know that if, uh, just not to pay more than this, because in theory, if you're producing, well, if you produce this with that wheat that you bought, then you're going to lose coins. Uh, and if you use wheat that's really expensive with other products, you just won't get as much profit from those products. Uh, so, uh, so, uh, yeah. What is the break-even point for producing it? And, and you, you know, you might say, well, is it different uh, for whether you get a feed mill uh, that's fully start or non start No, it's exactly the same uh, because uh, that's just about how long it takes uh, but won't actually affect the actual uh, profit uh, and, and coins per hour uh, it, on the break-even point. Uh, right, so the break-even point, and so this means that if you were to buy it at this point, uh, and then you would convert it, all that wheat into wheat bundles, you would make exactly zero profit. Uh, which you might think, oh, well that's fine because I need the wheat uh, bundle to, to feed to my animals, so that may, might be fine with you. Uh, but I'll tell you what not to buy it at, because otherwise you'll be losing coins, and I'm sure you don't want to be doing that. Right, so the break-even point, so this means that if you were to buy all your wheat at an average of this exact price, it means that you would get exactly no coins, but you wouldn't lose any either. Right, so that break-even point, is 2.016 so uh 2.016 so rounded that's uh, virtually two coins so it is it's basically two coins so two coins exactly two coins so for example that means that for example anything above uh court for example wheat if you're buying 10 wheat don't pay any more than 20 coins for that uh, so if you're paying 20 on the 20 exactly, since uh, the break-even point is just the fraction slightest, that means that if you're buying 20, uh, if you're paying uh, like two coins for one wheat, or you're paying 20 coins uh, for 10 wheat, you'll be getting zero coins. So that's about the break-even point. If you're paying 21 coins uh, per 10 wheat, or 2.1 coins per wheat, you will lose coins. You will lose money producing this product. So I don't recommend ever paying any more than 20 coins for wheat. I, I, I wouldn't recommend paying 10 because it's so easy to get it for cheap. But if you are, just for the, your information, don't pay any more than 20 because then if you produce this product, you will be losing coin. And, and as I say, this product here, it's not this product specifically. It means that when you produce other products, you won't get as many coins. It doesn't, you won't lose coins, but you won't get as many coins. Whereas this product, you'll actively lose coins because it's such a, it's such a fine balance between how much, because so much of the content is wheat. Uh, so that is very special. Uh, that's very important for this coin. So if you are paying 19, uh, 19 coins, uh, for the wheat, uh, then uh, 19 coins for 10 wheat, then you'll be making coins, not many, but you'll just be making coins. Uh, but if you can get it for 0.1 coin, 
coins, which is one one coin for ten wheat, you'll be making a lot of money, approximately a hundred coins. Uh, and I said the calculations before. So I just thought that was absolutely fascinating. And so remember, no more than 20 coins, because otherwise you'll start losing coins producing that product. Right, so, uh, well, you lose coin, like, as in you, you miss out on coins producing any other product, but you actively be losing coins uh, by producing it if you're producing this product in particular, uh, because it's, yeah, it, it's not, it, yeah, because wheat is, so, there's so much wheat involved. Uh, anyway, right, so, uh, I love it how it, uh, okay, and I said that, I talked about that, oh yeah, uh, I, I love this product, this is my favorite product, literally my favorite product, uh, I love, you know, planks, and you know, they're beautiful, uh, but this has got to be the most amazing product Supercell's released, I love it, I absolutely love it. Uh, I no, I was just thinking for a second I could replace the B with this. I'm not doing that, but still, it comes, it, it almost comes close. It, it is a good, good product. Uh, right, and so uh, now, and I will just right. Okay, so now remember my prediction. I reckon that it will fill these wheat bundles will fill the market, and lots of players will probably be losing coins doing that. I don't think that's a bad thing. Uh, I think it will make players be smarter uh, with what the the wheat cost they buy if they work it out. If they don't work it out, well, they're just going to lose coins. But they'll probably end up being very careful with the wheat they buy, and so then it will mean that players selling it for thirty six coins won't sell it. It's just not ever going to sell for them if people finally realize because of a mass wheat product that has been released. Uh, but now, and before you complain, like that player did on the forms, sure you can make an observation, you can you can speculate and say, oh, I think, and I'm sure you can complain, but I offer this counter-argument, uh, and, and that is this. Uh, it is that... Fit, like and this this is what is the beauty of this product. This product represents uh, lots and lots of wheat, lots and lots of wheat. And so for every ten of these you make, so for every ten wheat bundles, so that's uh, if you using this and make it one, two, three, and then three point one times because we're talking about if you get ten wheat bundles in total because this produces three. Then that is cost that uses 250 wheat to create. 250. That is a lot of wheat. And so now, before you go complaining to Supercell saying, oh, if we produce it for 3.6 coins, we lose coins. Uh, if we buy the wheat for 3.6 coins, we lose coins. Remember this, with the ad slots in the market, hopefully there's nothing good on the front page. Okay, that's, that's pretty good. With the ad slots in the market, for every, literally, this, this is how amazing it is. For every wheat bundle ad there is, there would normally be 20, get this, 25 regular wheat articles. So, uh, how many are there? So, there's uh, 1, 2, 3, 5, uh, then that's 11, uh, right, I'll, I'll just count 6, uh, okay, so, uh, I, I forget how many, so there's uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, uh, 9 times 6, 54 minus 1, 53, right, so 53, uh, things in here, so, uh, wait, is that, that's, is that right? No, it doesn't seem right, maybe it's right, oh, I think it's right, I think it's right, 53, because there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 pages, 9 times 6 on each page, 54, yeah, minus 1, yeah, 53, I think it is 53, uh, I think, that'd be awkward if it's not, I th it's, come on, it's gotta be 53, I'm just, uh, that's, okay, uh, 6, 12, 18, uh, 24, 30, 36, 42, uh, 42, 42, 42, 48, 49, 50, 50 yeah, it is 53, it's, sorry, I just, it was 53, uh, anyway, now get this, for every slot, an ad, which eventually they'll fix the bug and you'll be able to sell it, I'm sure, uh, the wheat bundles, for every one ad the wheat bundle takes up, it is saving you 25 other wheat ads, because 250 wheat go into producing 10 wheat bundles, right? So, and if, yeah, the, the calculation, uh, I, I got it anyway. But it, 250 wheat go into producing 10 wheat uh, bundles. Now, that translates into 25 ads worth of wheat. Now, if you have this one wheat bundle, that is representing 25 slots of wheat not being advertised. And so, for example, it's like it's compounding the wheat. It, it's putting all the wheat into one slot. So one wheat, ten wheat bundle slot represents twenty-five. So that, uh, since this is fifty-three, 
if you had two wheat bundles, two wheat bundles, that means that uh, theoretically there'd be the whole, uh, if you had two wheat bundles, it means that the whole newspaper, because there's 53, so then uh, since it represents 25 wheat ads, then it's 25, so 50, so basically the whole thing would normally be wheat, and so instead it's been all put into two wheat bundles. And so for every wheat bundle you see, a ten, ten, if you see an ad with t advertising 10 wheat bundles, know that had wheat bundles not been introduced, that, that, that would be, there'd be 25 extra wheat ads, which means that probably most of the stuff on anything that's not wheat in the article would probably have been wheat had that wheat bundle not been invented. Uh, so that, that's just something very interesting for you to think of. And so, which means, uh, not so much, well, it, it also means that the, the, uh, that it will take up, that it will use up the wheat, but it, uh, not only that, uh, it means that there'll be less wheat, there'll be, there'll be more slots for other things, and so, uh, although you might see, for example, let's say, I don't know how it will turn, if it will turn 50%, uh, of the current wheat in the newspaper, it will turn, uh, 50% wheat, and then 50% of the wheats in the newspaper will turn to wheat bundles, I don't know, but I, I, I I reckon that overall you'll see a massive decrease in the amount of wheat slash wheat bundles that have been advertised in total in the sense that uh, I reckon lots of those wheat slots will be converted to other products other than wheat because that wheat will have been used in the wheat bundle. So every time you see a wheat bundle advertisement, be thankful because you, you, you can know that that represents 25 slots that would have been wheat, which means probably virtually the whole newspaper. So if you see two of them in the newspaper then know that if had the, had the wheat bundle not been invented, virtually the whole uh, newspaper would have been wheat. So that is just uh, something to keep you thinking about. Uh, so, wow, this I've done a while on this video, I know, because that's now ready. Uh, so this year, I absolutely love doing this video. Uh, working out some of the stuff, it was like mind-boggling. It was really, it made me really, really think about, because uh, I was having to calculate stuff and the wheat bundle, and, and I loved, I, I just absolutely love the wheat bundle. It is like like literally the coolest product in heyday uh, because of its properties and, and the fact that it's diverse and the fact that the wheat, uh, people that do weeding will love it because it burns the most wheat. People that are uh, overnight, that get, uh, overnight that will be a fantastic product to put on because it, it takes so long to make. So it will probably re uh, n uh, not reproduce, uh, will replace goat feed. So overnight, rather than just filling it up with goat feed, this is assuming that you've got all the feed you need, people will put wheat bundles instead. And so it will, it like people that don't play that much heyday will love it because they'll be able to put that on assuming they've got other uh, regular uh, normal feed for the other animals and weeders can get rid of it as well as that it's got the fascinating property of being able to produce you about 100 coins an hour or make you lose 100 coins per hour how cool is that with one product all depending on the cost of the ingredient I think it is absolutely amazing and I, I really hope this video helped because I just it, it took me a while to put together but it's literally there's so many ideas I had about it and I wish I could elaborate it on all the ideas but that would make a very very long video I tried to get the basic gist of all my ideas uh, and, and, and talking about the wheat bundle the most it's just it's absolutely amazing and it will help overall it will absolutely help it will reduce the wheat problem uh, and 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 right and so I really uh, do hope you enjoy this video uh, so thank you so much for watching please like it if you did it learn something and come on you had to learn something you had to learn something there was so much stuff in there that you you would not have known that you lose a hundred coins uh, like seriously the, Please just like the video if you did enjoy it, uh, and please subscribe if you haven't already done so, and I'll leave you with, with, with my favorite pun. Wheat bundles will solve the growing wheat problem. I love that. Anyway, this has been Superside, and remember to make coins faster than honeybees make honey.